Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome here if you are new. My name is Carrie and today's video I'm going to share with you my Walmart grocery haul. So I spent $2.26 I believe. I'll leave like a screenshot on the screen just to be safe. Um, but this should get us through two weeks. I have been trying to shop every two weeks. It's just much more convenient than having to shop weekly. Um, and then this week I did utilize the Walmart grocery delivery since it is Sunday and I really just did not want to go spend my Sunday grocery shopping. So super convenient. And I did sign up for like the free month of deliveries. You get kind of get like a trial. So you can try it out and see if you like it. So far, I love it. It's so convenient to order your groceries online and just have them deliver them to your door. And it is, um, I believe it's pretty affordable. So I'll leave a link below if you want to try it and check it out. Um, but let's go ahead and get right into this haul. All right, so we're going to start on the island first and then just work our way around the kitchen. So starting over here with non-food products, I have a big pack um, of toilet paper. We love the Scotts toilet paper. It lasts a long time, and I'm making sure we don't run out of toilet paper this time because the virus is getting pretty bad here in Florida again, and I'm worried people are going to buy out the toilet paper. <laughs> so I made sure I got a big pack, and this will last us like two to three months, I believe. So got that. I also got this um, laundry soap. This was actually a substitution. So you can choose on the app if you want them to substitute or not. I don't really mind. So they didn't have the Purex um, sensitive skin soap. So they ended up um, substituting it for this one. I've never tried it. It is not scented whatsoever, which is kind of good because I'm very, I have very sensitive skin. So I'll try that out and I'll keep y'all updated. I also got some um, dish soap, some dish washer detergent. I also grabbed some kitchen um, garbage bags, some Sensodyne Pro Namel toothpaste. We love this toothpaste. It's great if you have really sensitive teeth. So we got that. I also grabbed a pack of razors. We have one, we already have one of these, so we just needed an extra cartridge. So now my husband and I both have one. So I usually just try to buy these because they're cheaper than buying the whole pack of cartridges. So got that. Um, and then this is supposed to be over here. What else did we get? Um, I showed you guys the toilet paper. So we'll go back over here. I got some yogurt. I just got this big pack of strawberry and peach mix. Um, some chocolate milk. We have some regular milk back there. Um, the Nature Bliss coffee creamer. I love this coffee creamer. It's so much better than the Great Value one. And it's really not that expensive. It's not that much more to get like the all natural one. So I grabbed that. Got some orange juice here. Some pepper and onion blend. I like to use these on om like for omelets, um, hot dogs. Yeah, I can put it in my spaghetti. So there's so many ways you can use these throughout um, the week. So I grabbed those. I got two bags of cut green beans. We have two cans of homestyle chicken noodle soup. I love to have these on hand. Um, and I've mentioned it before in the past couple hauls that I am kind of stocking up on canned foods. Um, for this hurricane season. So that way I'm not spending like a ton of money all at once. I'm just trying to grab a few things here and there. So I like to grab these, especially the ones that are um, easy to pop open without a can opener. I got some Hormel chili to go with our hot dogs. Um, these are for my husband. He likes to take these for lunch. So he's got beef and vegetables and steak and potato. Got a big bag of pink lady apples. These are our favorite. Um, over here we have some cereals. Dylan picked out the Tutti Fruities and the Honey Smacks. And then I got the kids two boxes of the Nutri-Grain waffles. One for this week, one for next week. Um, I got a big thing of coffee, some bananas. I had to get some more syrup because we were out. But I usually like to buy, um, oh, I can't remember the brand. It's just like natural. It doesn't have any... Um, it's more natural than this, but it's fine. I personally do not like when uh, syrup is flavored. They did substitute this, but it's it's okay. I have some left over, and I'll just I'll use it up. It's not a big deal. But moving on, I got some ranch here, some sweet baby rays. This is my favorite barbecue sauce. I love it so much. Um, and then I got some carrots for the kids to snack on. We got some cheese here. These are just for sandwiches, grilled cheese, or just regular ham and cheese sandwiches. Some uh, sweet cream butter, unsalted. All your gravy mix for sandwiches. I love to make this um, and just dip our sandwiches in. You can make a regular sandwich or a toasted sandwich. It does not matter. All your gravy is the best with any sandwich. It doesn't matter. It's so good. If you like like a, 
it's it's one of those flavors. I don't even know how to explain the flavor of this because it's so good. But you got to try it out. If you've never tried it, give it a chance. My husband actually got me on this when I met him. I had never dipped my sandwich into any type of sauce ever. <laughs> and I remember the night that he made this, I was thinking, I am not eating my bread soggy. But it is so good. So I got that. I got some roast beef, black forest ham. I got the kids some pizza Lunchables and then some ham and American cheese Lunchables. Um, the Tostino's pizzas, we always have those on hand for quick, easy lunches. And then we've got some Raymond noodles here. I got a big pack of the chicken and then four beef flavored. And then I grabbed a bunch of salads for me to eat throughout the week. Um, and honestly, this is enough salad for me um, to feed, share with the kids. They love salads too. So I got the Caesar salad with chicken and bacon. I got the chef salad with turkey and ham. Um, the Santa Fe style. This one was really good. I tried it last time and I loved it. So I grabbed that again. And then I got a Caesar salad with chicken. So those are just quick, easy, convenient lunches. I'm going to be super busy this week. So I wanted to have something that was easy for me to grab and go. Um, and then I got some flaky jumbo biscuits for sausage gravy this um, week sometime for dinner. I got a thing of sour cream here. Some paper plates. Swiss cheese, mozzarella cheese, and then Colby and Monterey Jack cheese. We love cheese. <laughs> well, I love cheese. Dylan likes cheese on some things, but he prefers like meats without cheese. I made a chicken parmesan meal one night. I'll link it below if you want to see it. He did not care for it, but I thought it was delicious. So now moving over here, we got a Supreme Pizza for dinner one night. These are the Walmart um, ones that they make. Or like, I think they're the Sam's Club. I don't know. They're really, really good. And there's plenty here to feed all of us. Um, it's a pretty thick pizza. And it, it actually rises a little bit. So we love those. I got um, some baby back ribs. This was $11.45 for this pack. Which is really affordable. And it will feed all of us. And then one night, we're going to make some um, subs. Or like, uh, what is it called? Meatball subs. Yeah, meatball subs. <laughs> so I got some meatballs, um, the marinara sauce for those, and then that's what the mozzarella cheese is for. And then I got some Prego roasted and garlic um, spaghetti sauce. I got another one of these roasted cracked black pepper um, pork tenderloins. We love these, and y'all, look how cheap this is. It's only $4.46. If you have a very large family, you can slice this up real small and serve it with rice, and it will feed like a large family super, super cheap. So I love these. They're like pressed, so it's actually bigger once you pull it out, and um, they're really good. I also got these Hebrew National Hot Dogs. I don't know who it was who commented and told me to try these out, but I am hooked. I'm literally hooked on these. Um, they're expensive, and they only come with six, which is weird, um, but it's enough to feed all of us, and they are the best. They're better than um, Nathan's, which is shocking, because y'all know I love Nathan's hot dogs, but I've been stuck on these. And then I got some Famous Seasoned Fries. These are the best french fries, and honestly, they're only like 20 cent more to buy these versus the Walmart brand Seasoned Fries, and I obviously would prefer these, and they're really good. So then moving over here, I got some bread. I always buy two loaves of bread. I freeze one and keep one out. And then we got these um, roll or these Subway breads for the um, sub sandwiches. What am I trying to say? The meatball subs. <laughs> I got those. We also got some hot dog buns for the hot dogs. And then I originally was going to make the um, meatball sliders, so I bought these. I forgot to take them off my order, so I accidentally got both, but it's fine. What I can do with these is do ham and cheese sliders one night just for a quick, easy, or even for lunch, a quick, easy lunch or dinner. So we'll use those up. Dylan picked out some donuts for snack, um, half chocolate, half um, glaze. And then we got some cake mix, some chocolate frosting for a dessert either this week or next week, and then some popcorn and then the last couple things we got were some waters um, recently I've been always trying to buy at least two cases of water and keep one on hand I've been just stacking them in my son's closet just so we have extra water just in case a storm sneaks up on us um, and then I have some uh, flavored water beverages these are the Capri Suns I like these because there's so much less sugar in them and the kids aren't you know, getting too much sugar. So if you have kids and they love Capri Suns, definitely make sure you look for the flavored water ones. To me personally, they even taste better. So I love those. And then I got me some Sprites. 
I don't drink soda that often, but usually if I do crave soda um, or like that carbonation, I like to drink Sprite because there's no caffeine. So I got those. And then they were sold out of vitamin water, and this is the only one they had. So they only gave us three of the tropical citrus, which is totally fine though. All right, you guys. So that is it for today's grocery haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I personally love grocery hauls. I like to watch them, especially at night whenever I'm bored and I'm just being nosy on what people eat. <laughs> so if y'all are the same way and you just absolutely love grocery hauls and you actually don't even get any ideas from people, you just like to watch it, let me know. So I know I'm not alone, but thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready Let me be honest I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me